Where are we? That's not what I wanted. Okay, we have things back. Okay, 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 okay. And we have... Ooh, so if we have that back... Oh, I know where we at. I know where we're at. Okay. One second. One second, everybody. I don't have a candle. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We'll just get away from them. Just look. Don't make eye contact. Do not look. Cool. Hopefully we're far enough back that we haven't beat the crap out of what's-his-face. I think his name was... I want to say Eddie, but that's totally not what his name is. Chillax. You're loud as fuck. Sorry. Oh, perfect. Okay. Eileen, are you, like, super effed up, like, now? Or did it happen when we were fighting earlier? We're trying to keep Eileen from not... Or, well, we're trying to keep Eileen from dying, basically, is what it boils down to. She was like, had we obscured? She sounded more like, she sounded more like Eileen. Hey, Kexfer. Hello. Thank you so much. Have a good rest of your day. I appreciate you stopping in. I really do. Thank you. Oh, yeah. This is the bitch. That bitch. We are not fighting him. No more fighting him. We're done with that. We're done with that. Unless the game tells us we have to, we ain't touching him. No more of that. That fucked us up last time. No. Just this. I remember this place. It looks a lot like downtown Ashfield. Good job. Candles? Yes, please. Look at that! We made it all the way. <gasps> Woohoo! Would you please? Ooh. I'm scared. No, I lean! I don't want to be. <gasps> Kitty, I need it! Pick up the cat. Pick up the cat. Pick up the cat. I lean. Leave it alone. Running in, put the cat in the box, and get out. <gasps> no! Oh, look at that. It's a cage. Whatever would I do with the cage? No! <gasps> oh, my God. Cynthia, leave me alone! <gasps> oh, my God. Let me... I'm not. That was a bad time. Yeah, green hair instead of a green thumb because I can't grow plants to save my fucking life. Oh, the cue ball! Give me that. Thank you. Hi, I'm here. 
Hi, would you like a cue ball? Um, there's a memo here. I want to see something because we did this last time. We did this last time. And, you know, we did the whole thing we had to do. Um, I want to see if I can just not go home. If I can just put the numbers in and if it will let me out because we have we have the we have the passcode oops i, I forgot it's the last it's the last four it's, i was tr like trying to dial the number yeah the game was like oh you're cheating oh there it is found it Okay, we have the volleyball. Okay, now it's just trying to figure out how the hell to get Eileen here. Because I don't know if I know how to do that. Ugh. Am I in another elevator? I am. Oh, what? I didn't sign up for this. Oh my god. Hi. No! Oh my god! There's a faster one! Okay. Absolutely kill that one. Oh god, another one's coming. Good one. Thank you, Ace. Okay. Those are monkey noises. I'm sorry, what am I looking at? It's a large spade. Ordinary spade from a construction site. It looks like it would be an impressive weapon. Revolver bullets. Sure. You could probably pin Cynthia down. You got nothing to say about that? Okay. <laughs> All right. Let me, I don't want to go get Eileen just yet. So I can't, okay, wait. Where does this take me? No! <laughs> we don't want to be there. So then let's go to the middle button, to the middle. Shut. Doors are shut. Okay, so the middle button doesn't work. Wait a second! I think I understand. 
Okay, why? Where are we? I can't hold anymore. I thought we already picked up bullets. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, so... Okay. Okay. Oh my god, I lean! This is indeed, this is the elevator I want you in. I'm gonna be right back. I need to go pin Cynthia to the goddamn ground. At least we have her in the right one, I think. Oh, I don't wanna fucking be here. Or do I? Oh my gosh. Bitch. All right, excuse me, you're not the one I'm looking for. Looking for Cynthia? There you are. Come here, lady. Run, run, run. <laughs> okay, maybe I needed to call my roll there. Maybe I needed to call my roll there. Go. What are you looking at? <gasps> yes. All right, bitches, let's go. All right, bitches, let's fucking go. I'm amuleted up. sound of a clock from somewhere. That's right. I'm correct. No one judge me. We ran around for a long time last time. <laughs> what a fucking asshole. Okay, so we need to go to grab. We need to go get what's her face, Eileen, and then go to the pet, go through the pet store, which will not be nearly as dangerous because I have Cynthia pinned down. Okay, there is a door somewhere in here. On the other side. Okay, come on. Come on, Chica. Oh, hurry, 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 I mean. Perfect. Okay, I mean, let's go. Alrighty. Okay, this is the farthest we've been in this world so far. I'm trying not to leave Eileen behind. 
Everything is upside down. Good job. Okay. Nothing up there. Okay. Um Can we like reorient the camera? That'd be great. What do you see over here? I don't like how many pistol bullets it's giving me. <laughs> I really don't like how many pistol bullets it's giving me. That better have brought Eileen because she was a little further back. Oh god, we're here now. Okay. someone locked down, which might be Cynthia somewhere. No, leave me alone! <gasps> Why are you here, Jasper? Eileen, we literally cannot stop, babe. Well, I appreciate you stopping in to say hi. Schnick. Oh my god. It's got a weapon! Oh my god. What is happening? Get it while it's down. Get it while it's down. Oh, I am so sorry. I am gonna kill Eileen at this point. Oh my god, Eileen, you're a god. Oh, Eileen, you're queen! Eileen, that was hardly fair. You saw all that shit? That was hardly fair. <sighs> Me too, girl. Me too. Oh, oh my god. Okay, Eileen, I need you just to run. I'll aggro him. Eileen. Eileen, hurry, babe. Oh my god. Oh my god. Eileen, leave him alone. Oh, we're here. Yeah, fuck you, Cynthia. Leave it. <sighs> oh, Lord have mercy. This is where Eileen dies. <sighs> Jesus. 
Jesus. Eileen. Eileen, run. Just run. Eileen, just run. Eileen, just run. Are you kidding me? Eileen, you beast! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to leave you. I legitimately didn't think it was there. I thought it was below us. You have every right to be. Oh, they're going after her. Interesting. She's getting her shit kicked in. Eileen, please. Back up, baby girl. Really, what happened to the city? Or are we just going insane? Oh, baby girl. So, I don't know how to. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't know how to answer that. Um, I don't know how to answer that. So, oh, she's not good. Okay, come on, I mean, I'm about to do fantastic. All right, Aileen, are you ready to leave this godforsaken place? Things are happening. Oh, we have a boss fight. Wait, there's a message carved into the door. To reach the deepest part, you must defeat the one truth. So do so and this door will open. Leave Eileen there. Okay, good. I did. Okay. Uh... It's cold. Help me. It's him. He's coming in. Eileen, I don't know how to help you right now. I literally don't know how to help you. I think we have to kill all of them. I think that's the way. Okay. I think Eileen is bleeding. Oh, cool. Oh, Eileen is 
gonna fucking die. Oh, it's this one. Eileen's got it. Good job, Eileen. Watch out. Oh. I'm trying, Eileen. I would love to just whistle her to go into a corner. We're gonna be able to do this, guys. I think we're gonna die. Not that one. Not that one. I'm dead. They're so dramatic. The deaths are so dramatic in this game. Look at her. This is just horrible. Yeah, you look pretty horrible. Oh, she's not good. She is no bueno. No bueno. Bad ending is incoming. I feel it. Oh, girl, I, I believe it. We've been through hell and literally back. To be fair, is it, I think we're like saving her from death. Like we're pulling her back out of the world of the dead. Like she was like barely alive and we're like saving her. We're trying to. It's not going well. Oh god, we're at the bottom. Cool. Eileen, hurry. I want to save, and I never want to go back there ever again. A sentry. Oh, good and no. Cool, my door is haunted. There's a scrap of red paper stuck here. Number one, 10 heart. Number two, 10. Number three, 10 hearts. Number four, 10 hearts, Steve Gar. Number five, 10. Number six, 10 hearts. Number seven, 10 hearts, Billy Locaine. Number eight, 10 hearts, Miriam Locaine. Number nine, 10 hearts. Number 10, 10. Number 11, Assumption, Walter Sullivan. Number 12, Void. Number 13, Darkness. Number 14, Bloom. Mo Number 15, Despair, Joseph Schreiber. Number 16, Temptation, Cynthia Velasquez. Number 17, Source, Jasper Gain. Number 10, Watchfulness, Andrew DeSalvo. Number 19, Chaos, Richard Braintree. That's the, that was the one that um, we were just running away from. Number 20, Mother. Eileen Galvin. Number 21, Wisdom, 
Henry Townsend, August 7th. Okay, back away from the door before it literally kills you. Fucking door. It'd be like really great if, you know, maybe there was some healing potions just randomly in my house. I don't know. Let's just look out the window at normalcy for five seconds. So we were over there at Hotel South, uh, South Ashfield. We were, that's where we were at just a second ago. Oh, good. That door looks normal. That red ass door. Cool. Love to see it. Don't mind if I just slip on out. <laughs> All right, Eileen, it's time to go fucking die again. Cause we are low on health, baby girl. Come on, Eileen. We got lots of shit to do. I'm sorry, what? Baby girl, I know. My fucking leg hurts. <laughs> There's a diary on the ground. I had that weird dream today. The one with the man with the long hair and coat. He was crying and looking for his mother again. I saw that man with the coat 10 years ago at this apartment. He was going up the stairs carrying heavy tools, an old looking bowl and a bag that was dripping blood. I never saw him again after that. But a few days later, the neighbors complained that they heard strange noises coming from the supposedly empty room 302. So I took a look around room 302 and found signs that someone had been in there, but nothing odd other than that. But that's when it all started. I still hear strange noises coming from the window of room 302. Sunderland. You put the superintendent's diary, man with the coat, in your scrapbook. Catch your breath. Actually, is there anything in here? Let's just make some quick rounds. Make sure we're not missing anything. Any goodies? Nope. Cool. Let's go die. Oh. Good. You love to see it. It's an old picture book and a red book here. There once was a baby and mother who were connected by a magical cord. But one day, the cord was cut, and the mother went to sleep. The baby was left all alone. But the baby made lots of friends at Wish House, and everyone was very nice to him. The baby was happy. His friends told him how to wake up his mother, so that the baby went right away to go and wake her up. But the mother wouldn't wake up. No matter how he tried, she wouldn't wake up. Because the one that he was trying to wake up was actually the devil. The baby had been deceived. Poor baby. The baby cried and cried and cried. When he thought of the mother, he remembered the feeling of being connected to her through the magical cord. Just then, a ray of light came down from the sky. The light was very warm and made the baby feel good. When the baby looked into his hand, he saw that the magical cord was laying there. With the cord clutched in his hand, the baby went happily to sleep. Gross. <laughs> I know where that cord is. Crimson Tome. She who was called the Holy Mother be not holy one wit. The descent of the Holy Mother is not but the descent of the devil. Those that be called the 21 sacraments not be sacramental one wit. The 21 sacraments be not but the 21 heresies. To give birth to the realm of wickedness within the blessed realm of our Lord be blasphemy and the work of the devil. If thou would stop the descent of the devil, you must bury part of the conjurer's mother's flesh within the conjurer's true body. Thou must also pierce the conjurer's flesh with the eight spears of void, darkness, gloom, despair, temptation, source, watchfulness, and chaos. 
Do so, and the conjurer's unholy flesh will become that which what once it was by the grace of our Lord. Cool. I have a pickaxe of despair. Is that what you're referencing? Um, considering the candles banish all of the baddies, I'm feeling pretty safe in here, Eileen. I don't know about you. Eileen, don't, 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 don't question why there's a, a peephole dug into your apartment. Um, I did not put it there. Twas not me. Um... Oh, look, pictures. Can I talk about the pictures? No? We good? Okay. Oh! Oh. The gate to hell. Why must I destroy this wall? Interesting. Hi! Oh, good! This is where it all started. Look at my bathtub's not bloody yet. Can I go in here? Oh, I don't know if I wanted to go in here. Oh. My God. Okay. There's a piece of red paper. What's with this room? It's covered in blood and rust. This is my room, but what the hell happened to it? This room. Is it really my room? It's in terrible shape. The air is so heavy. My head hurts. Creepy. It looks like a face. What the hell am I writing? August 2nd, Joseph. piece of red paper. I can't break down the wall. August 3rd, Joseph. When the bell rings, Eileen equals mother's body. Blood. August 4th, Joseph. Gross. The crimson tome Bury part of the conjurer's mother's flesh within the true body of the conjurer. Part of the flesh equals Super's room? August 5th. Yes, the part of the flesh is indeed in the Super's room. Look at this typewriter. It's so nice. Oh, can we just like lay down for like a fucking nap for like five seconds? <laughs> okay, well... Are we not going to talk about the blood stain on the ground? Rooms touch shut tight. Okay, just making sure I haven't missed anything. I'm sorry. It's him. What the fuck? You've done well to make it this far. Let me tell you something about him, Walter Sullivan. When he was a little boy, he began to believe that my apartment was actually his birth mother. He decided to free her from the stains and corruption of this world. At the orphanage, he learned of the 21 sacraments, the only way to purify her. He then performed the ceremony of the Holy Assumption and created this twisted world. Now, he's become nothing more than an inhuman killing machine. Well, He's dead now, but he's still trying to complete the 21 sacraments. His boyhood desire to return to the bosom of his birth has divided him. Now his child self has manifested itself in this world, and soon He's planning to finish his work, the 21 sacraments. Number 20, the mother reborn. 
Eileen Galvin. Number 21. The Receiver of Wisdom. Henry Townsend. Even now, it may not be too late. Follow the crimson tone. Stop him. If not, wherever you are, he will catch you. Find him. His true location. It must be nearby. You must kill him. You must kill him. Kill. 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 after that how you feeling after that Eileen you feeling good I'm feeling great what's this a pickaxe stuck in the wall take the pickaxe pickaxe of hope hope is written on the handle it doesn't look like I can use it as a weapon can I use it on the wall <laughs> oh Eileen let's use it on your wall okay cool <laughs> You think we gotta go through the hole, babe? I'll wait. Make your way. Hey, softest, welcome in. Eileen, are you coming? So I have a pickaxe of hope that is not a weapon. And I have a pickaxe of despair, which is a weapon. And that, that's a thing that's happening in my apartment. So... Um, can I, like, look through that still? Because I would like to. It's haunted, but it'll let me. Wait a second. I'm having a brain blast. I'm so fucking smart. I'm so smart. This is it, second to last episode. I hope you've enjoyed my arguably second best or favorite Silent Hill of all time. <laughs>